Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am the old guy. We are here on Skybounds and ready to rock and roll. So let's get at it. They just did a re server reset uh, for the updates. I don't know. They didn't update the sign, so I'm not sure what they updated but we'll find out eventually but let's we got plenty to do without that hopefully they'll get us to yep all right good we're at ancient so let's go home and to start off with let's get our remember to get our loyalty this time 125 i don't think that's going to be enough to get us up so yesterday after that episode, I saw that there was a competition for the most Iron Golem kills. So I came up here and grinded away on the Iron Golems. And it's pretty easy, but I did go ahead and buy a second Iron Golem spawner since we have so much money now. And the way I do it is just go right around along here and just whack them. I just I think I showed you that before. Helps if you wait until they catch on fire and they're in the lava because then when you whack them they won't they won't move. So anyways, I did that for a while. And when I logged in today, I got a second place reward spinner. So we are going to open that if there's a challenge booster on and then we've got some other openables to get to so let's just see what nope no global boosters on so we'll wait for that I did reroll my dailies yesterday so I'll go ahead and finish this up and we'll have yeah we should I should be able to get that done later today the other thing I wanted to do was to come into the challenge selector and if you remember yesterday or the day before we had a had to brew a potion and I didn't have the right recipe and I had to go and buy that potion recipe and it was pretty expensive but I wanted to unlock the recipe librarian I'm looking at my spreadsheet of usefulness and right there sure enough is the recipe librarian librarian to open five potion recipes so as soon as a you know I've got this challenge booster let's see so I could open that and I've only got this one pearl fragment to alchemize and I've got so let's go and make a run around and look and see if we've got I want to look at the witch spawner to see if we've got more arcane dust don't see any zombie oh good good and an arcane shard good so we'll go ahead and snag that and then maybe see if we've got any more pearl fragments from the ender dropper no, we just got ender pearls. I'm gonna go ahead and just clear that out while I'm here. And I uh, yeah, spawn. Alright, so let's go put this stuff away. Try to keep an eye out, see if a challenge booster gets activated here. Be real handy for us. Oops, looks like we might not have enough room for all my ender pearls, so I need to, should have an empty, yeah, I want to leave those sand, and there's more sand there, and we'll put them in here, I'm going to put these in here, and that iron in there, and the ender spawner is in here, which spawner is in there, to be alchemized in here. Oops, which head? Right. Nope, didn't miss it. So I've got 591 more until level 34. So let's go ahead and we can pop this off ourselves just so that we get this reward spinner 
and then I will also go and do the alchemy that I can and do the XP that I can and that should be enough so we'll go ahead and pop this off maybe we'll even get some thanks XP out of it so there we go we just popped off the global XP multiplier for a second place Ooh, that'd be good that'd be good that wouldn't be good that wouldn't be good uh. <laughs> Cyan wool. <laughs> uh, that would have been nice. Oh, jeez. Even the arcane dust, and then a zombie's gonna come at me. Really? Alright, fine. Oh, I did finish uh, building. I did some, some more build out here. Chaos Emerald. I'm not sure we'll use that, but for the abandoned fortress over there I went ahead and put at least a skirt around it and then since I had used a Floyd orb I went ahead and and put some more dirt out that way so at least we got a little bit more land to work with we'll probably put some more farm animals over here oh so yeah so now the other thing I want to do is I can do that Since I, I put that global XP booster on, put that in there. I'll go ahead and quickly do that. So we're gonna do CH challenge selector. It's here. And select that, and then we'll do five of these. So I'm gonna do three of those and two of these. Give me something good. What was that? Uh, you can buy those in the market. Well, at least it's a. So, what was those? Five? So I think I can just escape out of this. What was that one? Prospector two. That was that was the potion that we needed before. Ooh, a prospector three. The potion itself. We might put that down. Uh, let's see. So seven meters. Hmm. I'd like to have my stone mace next before I use that. So and then we got an Arctic Splash potion that's not the greatest. I'm gonna escape out of this one. Prospector three, Ultra Strength, Everbloom. Eh. Ooh, Necro. There is a challenge to brew a Necro potion, I believe. What was that one? Vortex 1. I don't think there's any for that. Let me just escape through these because I don't want to run out of the challenge booster. I still have to do my alchemy and my sorcery. That would have been a good one to get. Oops. There we go. So we got some good XP on that one. Yeah. Alright. Let's go put these away. Potions, let me see here. Everbloom is not that good. Arctic is not, is not that good. Prospector 3 is an important one. Disarray, I might want that one. Potion of Invincibility, that's a good one. Starvation, eh. Alright, so let's do our alchemy real quick. We only got these two things to do. Slash elk. 
and we got more ender pearls we didn't need. Oops, this one I'm gonna put up here. Got some dust. Grab my XP here, so this should be in quite a bit. And some dust. Let's see. We'll use uh, two, three, four, five. I got some there. We'll just take some of that, and then just use a little bit of this, and then type sorcery. And let's see. So we'll just chunk this lesser up there. We got quite a bit, so 33, so all right, then one, two, three, three, four, one more. There we go, so we max that out. And let me put the this away. And I need to put a sign on that guy. Or I'll forget. So that's done. That's done. Let's go ahead. We don't have very grab a bite to eat here. We'll go ahead and do our other openables. We got a farming ruin, ancient ruin, buried treasure, and another ore seed box. So let's go ahead and put these guys down in our brand new land over here. Put that one down and that one down. Ooh, we got some pants of some kind. Oh, and it's some, and some more and more boosters. And somebody blew me up, and there's a skeleton over here getting busy on me, and a creeper showed up. Good grief. I think they'd learned by now. So yeah, so these are those are some pretty good pants. Those are pretty nice, and then the immortal booster. Jeez, did it say in chat what which one? Let's see. So there was that. Place an ancient ruin. So the the farming ruin gave me two immortal boosters. So that's gotta be a tweak that they did in the update because that makes farming ruins really, really good. <laughs> So we're going to be doing some more farming. I know that. All right, let's just throw down this ore seed box. I'd like uh, maybe emeralds. I think I used up all my emerald. Let's see, iron ore, diamond block, and prismarine. Eh, I think I've got a bunch of iron. But now with that prospector, we could put the iron down. And using the prospect it would upgrade it to gold so yes yeah, so i need some more iron right, let's put these popsicle pants over here one of these days we're going to go start taking some of these like that burn five and evasion five i need there's a tank three on those. That's a good one to take off. Tank one. So I'll have to I'll have to start thinking about that, about taking some of these off, and then also looking at what I've got here. So let's see. So all right. So we did our openables. We've got. more potion libraries I think I'll save these I'll save those for another round of those challenge so I could use two more of these oops and that would still give me enough to do two, that challenge two more times plus I'm pretty sure we'll get some more out of the witch drop I have been looking since we have all those stars to see if somebody has gear from an immortal kit that I could buy and I'd like a full set of either Santa 
or Pharaoh because they provide you extra stuff once a day. You can, uh, from the Santa kit, you can get a, uh, a little gift box that has three items and then from the Pharaoh you can get a random, a random uh, relic uh, or something else. So those would be one of the good ones to have. Vortex. I don't think these are any good. Prospector one again. Rupture. And a disarray. Now right, let me put these away. So I think what I'll do. I might be doing is so I've got five these stack oh good they stack finally so I got seven of these maybe I'll try to see if somebody wants to trade let's take a quick look around the islands while we're see if anybody's got any eye kit gear We'll start with Fortune 6 here. That's a gear. Then this guy have Thief, Phoenix, Zombie, nope. God gear is not open. I see another shop over this way at Weenie Hut Jr. Ooh, minor stuff. They're all out of stock, though. That one would be worth five million stars. If, if, if I see a, one of these pickaxes, I would buy it for five million stars. Open oh, a creeper, 35 million. No. That's closed. All right. So we were... We are on Fortune 6, so let's go ISBrowse. Browse. Uh, let's see if this one has... I don't think so. He said he's selling uh, wood food logs. Nope. And let's see. See what this one has. So, weapons, armor, healer, nope. Random stuff, forge essence, item XP, overflight, nope. Openables, that's too much, that's too much. Let's see, skill books, auto smelt, ooh. Stonemason 6 for 600k. I don't remember what I've got. Power, that's a bow enchantment. War seeds, this one's closed. Alright, well, it doesn't look like anybody has anything we want except for that stonemason. Let me go check my enchantment crates out here. So that would have been here. So I've got. Got stonemason four. Stonemason six would probably cost me to get from four to six. Would probably cost about quite a bit of dust. Probably let's see one, two, three, four. So yeah, probably it's probably not worth six hundred k, seeing as how I've got this dust there. So. Ooh, that's what I should be. That's what I should have done. Oops, not that one. Stone Mason four. Yeah, I won't. I won't be able to get to it in time. So I should have while the challenge was going because upgrading books also counts as your alchemy bonus XP level. So you can see. I only I was only 140 out of 300, but upgrading books would have counted too. But 
again, I want to make sure I do it when uh, there's Global XP boost around, so I'll probably do that. I'll do that later, so I got some grinding to do. I need to go play Mining World games to finish off that challenge. Oh. Alright, so it was a 5,000 challenge. Yeah, so that's going to take me three or four Mining World games to get through. And then I'll probably re-roll that. I think the next re-roll is only 8,000 stars, so I'll probably re-roll that again. Let's take a quick look. X, the competitions zombie kills would have been a good one what do we hear but there's already yeah I might yeah it's not hardly worth it at this point to kill that many have to do quite a bit and ho XP all right well I'll take a look at that later tonight and I'll do some grinding on the mining world and we'll see if I can keep track and find any really good armor to buy with our 15 million stars. So anyways, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Make sure you leave any comments below on any questions you have or anything you want me to, you want to see or you want me to do differently. So that's it for this episode. Take care and be good.